remember like if you are dating with a girl that is way young than you it's going to be a headache believe me a headache because So today we're going to talk a little bit about that age gap uh, that is important to take uh, attention, to really, really pay attention to that. Rolando, I'm looking for a mature woman over 40. Sincerely, I'm not into younger. I will be turning 42 this weekend. I don't have time for a mujer that is playing games. So Rolando, you know what? It's great because tonight we are going to talk about the age gap. And usually I recommend to the guys don't go farther than 15 years. Maximum sometimes I say 20 years. Like that is a maximum, but it's like the limit of 20 years apart. If you want to be successful in your relationship, okay? Uh, remember, Colombian women are open to relationship with older people. This is a reality. If you have 60 years old and you visit Colombia today, I'm sure that you are going to find out maybe a 21, 22, 23 years old that is interested in you. But this doesn't mean that she wants to have a relationship with you. Sometimes um, the guys start uh, to visit Colombia and they get very excited because they realize that they have a lot of attention from girls that they don't have attention in them countries. So uh, sometimes happen that they get confused and they get lost in the process and they start to pick a lot of young girls. And I'm telling you like a big difference in, in age. And um, of course, this is not the idea. The idea is that if you are looking for something serious, that you stay focused in what you are looking for. Because if you get lost, you are going to lose your money, your time, your energy in something that is not going to give you nothing back. Um, there are reasons why a girl uh, most of the time accepts an uh, older man. And most of the time, I can tell you, that the first thing can be economic support. The second one can be trips, clothes, give details. But don't expect that a gay girl is going to marry or be happy forever with you uh, with when they have a really age uh, gap between you and the girl. Like I say, oh Manuela, what can be a big age gap uh, between a girl and, and me? Usually I say like 15 years old is much ma more than enough. But if we are going to be more flexible, I can say like maybe 20 years apart can be like a number to say it. Uh, but no more than that, guys. Please, I mean, I can tell you the, the time that I, I already say this and I already have this conversation with you guys. And sometimes you don't listen to me and in the end, the result is always the same. Uh, I know that for you, uh, it's important to find a girl that is a little bit younger because you say like, oh, a girl that is 35 years old can no longer to have children. So guys, I want to tell you something. We are in the new era. And this new era is that the girls, they can even be pregnant until the 44, 45 years old, approximately me. Uh, but uh, of course, a girl that take care of herself, a girl that uh, likes to have a good uh, uh, unhealthy lifestyle, but it's possible. Remember, like if you are dating with a girl that is way young than you, it's going to be a headache. Believe me, a headache because you are going to be wondering like, oh, what she is doing, she is being loyal to me, I can trust in her. So the relationship in the distance is not going to work. And sometimes, most of the times happen that these girls, they just disappear during the weekends. And during the week, she is the most lovely and nice girl. So be careful with this type of girls. Uh, some of the advices that we can say to you is like trying to improve your search process. Uh, there are beautiful, wonderful, amazing girls over 30 years old who will 
do anything for have a serious and a stable relationship with an stable guy. So they really value and appreciate that. Of course, one thing that I think is like, a, I cannot say that because the girl has 25 years old, is not going to be mature enough. Uh, to be mature, uh, that doesn't go with the age, that go, goes with the personality. And I know a lot of beautiful girls that they want to have something stable, but it's easy to create and build a family, a relationship when the age gap is close. Because when it's so, so big, in some point of the relationship, that can be a problem. Um, also, if, for example, you feel uh, that you have a really good connection with a younger girl than you, and it's happening, you feel that connection, and the girl is being nice with you, also you can consult uh, your matchmaker. Uh, you can ask about that profile, what she thinks about her, if she see maybe a red flag about the girl. Uh, and I'm sure that the matchmaker is going to be able to give you information to help you to take the decision. And remember, this is not like a rule. I'm not going to say that 100% of the time this happened like that. I have a uh, nice testimonies about people that they have a age difference and the girl is super mature, the guy is nice. But most of the time, guys, I have to tell you this is a waste of time because when the girls are super young, uh, believe me, they are looking for something different than you. And they are in that stage of life where they can look for that because they are in that moment of their life. Maybe you are not in that moment anymore, but you cannot expect that if you are 60 years old and you're dating with a girl that is, I don't know, 28 years old or even younger, uh, you cannot expect that uh, she don't ask you for things, that she don't ask for a certain kind of uh, how you say it, like help or support from you. So be clear about that if you date with a very young girl, she is going to expect this. And later I will say, don't complain with us. Oh, Manuela, look, she was just using me. I paid for this and that. and I, Because in the end that can happen, guys. And this can happen. It's like if you know that the guy is a womanizer for a girl. I know that this guy is super womanizing. Everybody told me about that. But I think like, oh no, maybe with me, he is going to be nice. Maybe with me, he is going to be different. We cannot close our eyes. We have to know that if something is not working and if that person is not having a good behave, why is going to have a good behave with you? There is not a very big probably probability that that can happen, right? Travel to exciting places and meet hundreds of stunning single women. Check out our website at medianwomen.com.